going on? What's going on? My Ferrari, and I was gonna keep it a secret, but I just couldn't keep it in. I had to tell you guys because the big cars, man, the fleet. So yeah, I sold my Ferrari, man. I didn't think I was gonna do it, but I did it because I replaced it with something else. What did you get? You just you just got your Ferrari. Why would you sell it? I I don't know, but I think you guys should so come over and see what me. I got instead. I have to this Ferrari. Yeah, can you give us any hints of what you got? I think it's better that we talk when you guys are here in person. Okay, alright, uh, we'll be on we'll be over there. We'll be we'll come into your house right now. Alright, just let me know when you guys are pulling up. Alright, bye. He sold his Ferrari A twelve? Yeah, he just he just uh gave me a call. He's like, Oh like I got rid of my Ferrari, like I wanted to try something new, like but I was just telling him that he just got it. So like I'm trying to think like I mean what do you guys think he got? I don't know, like I thought he was all about the B12, so yeah. maybe an Aventador. You think he got a, what do you, what do you think? Maybe like a Ferrari 296? Yeah, I think he, maybe he possibly went back to McLaren. Maybe. Maybe, maybe he misses McLaren. Yeah. I saw him wear like a McLaren shirt the other day. Yeah, and when I, when I went to the zoo with him, he had his McLaren bag. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, maybe he's like hinting, he was hinting at you that he's going to trade in his car. Dang. Like, what if you got a 765? Maybe. Let's go, oh. let's go check it out. You know Cyrus wants to be fast. So, yeah. like, the 765 is the fastest car right now, honestly. like. Make sure you guys subscribe and like this video. Comment down below what you guys think Cyrus got. What kind of car? Yeah. It's kind of sad, like, that he already got a new car. Yeah. Yeah. Hop in the G-Wagon, guys. We could take my car. All right. All right, so we're getting ready to pull up to Cyrus's crib. Like, any last-minute thoughts? What you guys think you may have copped? I'm going to say an Aventador, um, Aventador S. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I'm kind of confused on why he got rid of his 812 so fast, his Ferrari. Right? Yeah, I don't know. How long has he had it for? Probably like four or five months now. That's maybe. it? Yeah. And he's already getting rid of it? Yeah. Maybe he got bored of it or yeah. something. Yeah. That's the only thing I could think of. Maybe he got bored of the car. He wants a new experience. All right. <laughs> Should be coming out. Yo, what's up? Yo, you guys actually showed up. Yeah. yeah. What's up, you guys doing alright? Yeah, what's up? Nothing much, I guess, um, I'll show you guys <laughs> what I got. <laughs> I was just feeding the baby, but, um, we at the front of the garage, and I'll show you guys what's up. You joining, are you joining Team Lambo today? <sighs> it's something that none of us have. Okay. Mm. Oh. Okay. What do you, do you, can you just tell us what you got? I'll be right out. <laughs> I'm gonna... Just, just give me a, let me get the keys, just give me a few minutes. What, right, what, right. what brand have we got? An R8? Nah, he's gonna get an R8. Yo, he got windows here. Let's see if we can see the car. Yeah, try to peek. Let me know what you see. Can you see? Oh, no, it's tinted. You can't see through? No, nah, I can't. What about the door? Can you reach over? You can't see anything? No. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, no, yeah, you can't see through that. Something that none of us have gotten before. No I mean, like I mean, he, he's had an Aston Martin. Mercedes. Dodge had, Viper. Maybe a Dodge Demon 170. Maybe, yeah. Oh, yeah, the Demons. Yeah. Alright y'all, so I'm about to open the garage. Um, I'll be honest with you, I think this car will get as many looks as our other cars as well. It's it's pretty exotic. I don't know, the only hint I can give you is, hey old sport. Have you guys seen the movie Gatsby? Yeah. yeah. So it reminds you of that era, the roaring 20s. Alright? It's a classic, huh? Yeah, yeah it is. I always wanted a classic fresh. car. thing that we don't have in the fleet is a classic car so I had to add this this is called the gazelle that's sick yep. hey old sport hey old sport it took inspiration from the 1929 SSK Mercedes and um that cost like 3.5 million right yeah so yeah this is a 1920s car called the gazelle the engine itself is actually from the 1980s a Chevette and I don't know, this, the story around this car, man, the way I bought it and purchased it, I went to a car show with my Ferrari, and we were looking at these all these classic cars, historical, vintage, and Brenda was like, babe, look at that car, it's so nice. She was like, it's for sale. And there was an 87 years young man there, and he was like, look, I gotta sell it, you know, I already have three other cars, my wife wants me to sell it, so he made me a good deal, a good offer, and I bought it. I was like, I have to. I wanted a vintage car. That's but so, so you traded this in for the A12. This must have been expensive, right? Pretty much, I got rid of the A12 and used some of those funds for this, and the rest of the funds put in the savings, you know, for our future. So, um, so what, what happened with the A12? Are you just you got bored of it, or like you just 
this is not you anymore or I just want to try something new you know I want to give it a chance and maybe later on I'll get the A12 again but yeah. um, I wanted to go a little more chill mode you know with this car yeah so it's a 1.4 liter single overhead cam inline four and all Shut the cars yeah all the cars back then they used the belt to keep the hood closed that's crazy it's pretty cool all right Oh, it opens up that way. Oh, that's different. That's cool. Wow. Wow. It's pretty Yo, cool. It's so cool to see how, like, the different eras did things differently, you know? Like, what if they came out with a hypercar where the hood does open yeah. like that? Yeah, that's different. The classics are always in style, in my you opinion. Know? <laughs> it's actually really loud. Crazy. You look fresh in there, bro. Thanks, man. This is definitely kind of like an undercover car, you know? But not really, because it definitely stands out. It's definitely flashy. Whoa, this is cool. We're going back to the 1920s. Oh, let's go, sport. <laughs> it's fresh. All right, we're going to get in the G Wagon and follow you guys. All right, good. Yo, this is so cool. <laughs> this is awesome. This is actually really cool guys, the fresh air, you feel the breeze, and it's a lot of fun. POV is sick, like seeing this in front of us. I do feel like I'm in a different era right now. That's what it's all about, man. You know, gotta appreciate all the eras, you know? Yeah, of course. I mean, every, like, today's age got inspiration from the past, you know? So exactly. we gotta respect that. I'm actually having a lot of fun. It makes the ride so much more enjoyable, like, just feeling the air. I feel low to the ground. I mean, it's cool, it's different. <laughs> You gotta have fun, bro. Life is all about having fun and enjoying life because life is too short sometimes. You gotta enjoy your life. Do you miss your Ferrari yet or no? <sighs> Man, I love that Ferrari. You know, that was a life goal of mine, so for sure I miss it, you know? Yeah. But, but this is giving me a good thrill as well in a different way. Yeah, know? yeah. I agree. Let's go. Wow, it's awesome. Yo, who else wants to ride? Now the chance. Is insane. Go in, there, go in there, go in there. Get in there. Oh yeah, I, I, I'll get in there, that's cool. What is this? Oh, it's a cool experience. It's a really cool experience. Well, like, it's insane. It's a lot of fun. This right here is the <laughs> definition of a weekend car. This is the chill life. Yo! Yo! We chillin'. <laughs> this is fresh. We're so low to the ground. Yeah, it's low. And the hood is actually as long as the 812, like pretty close, like it's almost as long as the 812. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, the view is insane from here. And at night, all this lights up, it's just so cool. The, the lighting inside is just like, you feel like you're actually back in time. It's, it's crazy. I love nighttime drives. You definitely get looks in this car too. Oh yeah, it looks crazy. I mean, when I first saw it, when Brenda spotted it, I was like, what is that, yo? That looks wild. Alright, hope you guys had fun. Lucas Marks, you guys want to ride soon too. Yeah, we're yeah. down. But uh, you guys can check out the car. I gotta go to my mailbox real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah, bro, I'm not gonna lie. How was the ride? It was, it's chill, bro. It's very, chill. it's so low to the ground too when you're in there. So what do you guys actually think about him like treading in his Ferrari for this stuff? I think he's gonna miss it. I think he does miss it for sure. But he also has a kid now, so maybe he, he won't be driving it as much. It'll just be sitting. Yeah. But I don't know. Like I feel like even on times where he's alone, he would still want to take it out. So I'm kind of shocked he, he sold it, honestly. What do you think? Yeah. What does that sound? Yo, what? He still got it, let's go! Wait, what? Let's go! I knew he wasn't going to sell it like Yo, that. Yo, I'm happy he still got it. That's fresh. You guys actually thought I'd get rid of my Ferrari. I worked my whole life for this thing. Come on now. Yo, I knew yeah. you actually did it. Yeah, I had. I honestly, I had a feeling that he was pranking us, but 
That was a good point. That was a good point. I'm so happy you kept it, bro. I had to get a classic too, though, you know? Right. It's a good price, so now I feel like we have every style in the garage. Can you rev it for us, though, since you pranked us? <laughs> That was a good one, Cyrus. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I had to hide the keys because the gazelle also had the keys on this keychain, but I'm happy you guys didn't see it. I don't know, maybe the viewers saw it like here and there like when I was pulling it out, but I didn't even see that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I wasn't paying attention like that. Yeah, guys, so also I'm not getting the Revolto anymore. Nah, all right, that's a prank. Nah, that's, that's definitely a prank. Stay tuned because that car is gonna be here any day now, guys. <laughs> subscribe, 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 subscribe. All right, I love you guys. Don't forget to go watch our last couple of videos. Watch out for the pranks, y'all. Watch out for the pranks. You're getting crazy. Let's go. That's why. Fast is a lifestyle.